has come off as uh, creepy. Well, we're getting into another game here. <laughs> this game, a stalwart. Does that mean on it a lot? Or like a big part of it? This is before and after. Get ready to play before and afters. How this game works is two movies have been smushed together into one. I'll read you the smushed together plot. You have to tell me the smushed together title. Like before and afters on Jeopardy. A lot of them are portmentos. Uh... Argo, Saving Private Silverman, Wolf of Wally Street. We know these examples. You guys have both played before. Mm -hmm. uh, I like this with the paper. Isn't this better than the computer? Feels good, doesn't it? Doesn't this feel nice to have the paper printed out? And just I, I printed out just 800 extra copies just to get rid of all that paper I had just lying to around. Throw I it hate away. having blank paper. <laughs> I know. I got this blank paper. It's like, it could be art. Wash um, it down the toilet. Here we go. Feel free to work together. The score is currently 11 to 1. Winner gets to promote uh, projects at the end. Oh, Loser also gets two. Everyone oh. gets two. Oh, this is a, this is a good deal. <laughs> <laughs> uh, here we go. Oh, I want to give a shout out. So, so I have people on the Never Seen It Discord come up with titles. So they'll send me some titles and I'll write up the plots. Uh, Discord, just a big message board for fans of the podcast, people who like it. There's also a robot on there you can play before and afters against. So if you like play, if you want to play before and afters, or talk about the podcast, or really anything. With people who listened and never seen it, go to fart.kyleairs.com. I'm about to just get a different URL because I'm tired of saying it, or an additional one. But that'll that'll Keep redirect that. you to Discord. I know Discord's like an intimidating internet word. Yeah, because it's like a Reddit. I don't right, it. right. It's like a Reddit, um, but it's really easy. You just you it'll send you a link. You make your account, and then you just hang out on a message board and talk to other people, and they'll help you out. I'm 46, and I use Discord every day. Right. All right. I can. Dis it's not too late for me. Discord. Yeah, it's just the on internet. <laughs> uh, you know that you know how Discord's intimidatingly new. Here's a reference you might get: the song "This Kiss." Yeah. Uh, <laughs> here we go. Number one, you have to tell me the smushed together title. A Spartan king leads his badly outnumbered troops on a journey to find out why his girlfriend, named after a season, dumped him suddenly. Oh. I, you know, obviously it's, it's 300. Yeah, but then it read something. What's the second part again? What's the Spartan the King again? leads his badly outnumbered troops on a journey to find out why his girlfriend, named after a season, dumped him suddenly. Named after a season. Uh, it, oh, it, God, I'm trying to like, the, it's not eternal sunshine, if this follows mind. 300... Yeah, it's like three. High, no, yeah, there's yeah. there's no there's way. There's no way. But and also that would have like a more that would have a more a more detailed like yeah yeah but existential ish. Like, plot. A, okay, about a se named after a season. That means we got uh, what spring, summer, winter, and fall. autumn. Fall. Oh, autumn, autumn. It's got to be autumn. Like that seems to be who's is. I, I feel red, like red autumn hunt three hundred red uh, red the hunt for red autumn <laughs> red October. Is <laughs> You're changing the title red of a different autumn. movie to yeah. make it still not fit. Yeah, three hundred <laughs> three hundred judge dread yeah, autumn dread um, um, Kirsten Dunstan Jackson. <laughs> I'm trying to think of like uh, the movies with the the character where she's autumn or, or even spring or, or, or even summer. Spring. It's summer <laughs> or even. Or perhaps. Perhaps. I'll give this to her. Adventure fall <laughs> perchance uh, on the off chance <laughs> thou is spring. Thusly I say. <laughs> I spake unto thee. <laughs> it's declared. There's a bounce in your feet, thou hast spring. <laughs> a spring in your step. Uh, 300. That's the first one. Are we ready? Or do you <laughs> want the answer? Oh, this yeah. we know. <laughs> okay. We are looking for 300 days of summer. Oh, yeah, of course we are. Yeah. 300 days, days of summer. Of summer. Oh, 500 days of summer. I didn't think it was going to be all of 100. Of that's a... Yep, that's, right? that's where they get you. Well, that's, that was the easy one. You're the they. <laughs> that's, that's, <laughs> no, no. That's where you got No, no. Me. I didn't give a shout out to who wrote these titles. Okay. On the Discord, uh, we have Brand, Cheez-Its Christ, Aaron, and Moist. Uh, okay. Which that, I believe wait. are the pseudonyms. That's so that was like gang written. You believe? No, no, they wrote all. Our they, they came up oh, okay. with some, some of these I wrote and some of these titles. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> please, Moist is my father's name. Believe it um, to be a <laughs> Moist. Um, Moist the third. <laughs> <laughs> Could be Autumn. Some people Moist? really hate that word. Autumn. I mean, yeah, either either one. It's like um, get over it, dude. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Truly. So they wrote some of the titles. I wrote some of the titles. We all wrote, and then I wrote all these plots. Number two. <laughs> Two siblings who run a horse ranch in California come across cash 
at an at the aftermath of an alien hovering over a drug deal, and they are hunted down by a merciless killer. Nope, country for old men. Nope, country for old men. It is. Oh my god, that was fast. Nope, country for old men. I had it at two siblings. Was that <laughs> headed at two siblings? <laughs> I'm not kidding. I was like, well, I, I knew the nope part. It, I was like, okay, that's nope. Just out of, I don't know why. And then you were just like, waiting for con- like something like, that plays off. Like, what's gonna fit in here? Yep. Yeah. Wow, I don't know. Is it? I, uh, I guess nope. Hundred kind of days of summer. Genius. <laughs> I guess I'm some kind of practical brain. Can you just read the description one more time so I can understand? Two siblings who run a horse ranch in California come across cash at the aftermath of an alien hovering over a drug deal. Okay, I'm just trying to figure out. Oh, yeah. Alien Hover Cash yeah. Aftermath. Yeah, okay. What yeah, I did was I combined the plots of two movies, <laughs> um, and then you had to guess the title. Oh, wait. Okay. Get ready to play. <laughs> just in general. Get ready to play. Number three, the points go up one per each, so that was a two pointer. Nice. Okay. So this I'm is a three pointer here. A young redneck man recounts his time in Nazi Germany as he searched for his missing parents with his imaginary friend, Hitler, on a radio program. Oh, my God. I don't remember. I know the movie, and I don't remember the... A young redneck man recounts his time in Nazi Germany. As Ernest he's... goes to concentration camps. <laughs> Ernest, <laughs> Ernest goes to Auschwitz. <laughs> uh, no. <laughs> uh, a, a young redneck man recounts his time in Nazi Germany as he searched for his missing parents. What's that one? What's with the his first imaginary part? friend Hitler on a radio program. I What's think the people first? don't always remember the framing device to this movie. It, it's well, okay. So one of them is it's yeah, okay. One of them is Jojo Rabbit. Yeah. So something that has a Jojo, or at least a or a, or a bit. Some, oh, something like that fits a, in here like, or pisses or me rat. off. <laughs> <laughs> so a young, young, young redneck, redneck man. man. Recounts his time in Nazi Germany. I'm just going to search guess for his Banjo Joe Rabbit. You're thinking partially of a PlayStation video game. Banjo, yes. Banjo oh. Joe Rabbit Kazooie. Oh, yes. yeah. Um, As he searched for his missing yeah. parents. Who's the redneck kid? With his imaginary Germany. friend on a radio program. He's like, redneck kid's not in Germany. If, I mean, if you're like if you're trying to piece together what the. If you're trying to Germany rationalize part, this, you got to slow part. down. <laughs> Wait, it's the, the redneck kid is one part of is it. Is one part. And then Germany is the other part. Yeah. Um,. I'm assuming. I'm, unless a young like redneck a, man. A young redneck man. You guys man. keep saying That's kid. all we're getting about. Little boy. We're counting. You guys are like, that, that man. Man. what's that man? One? What that? <laughs> oh, oh, wait. What's that? Uh, the, oh, the idiot who got elected in Ohio. Um, he wrote the oh, book. Oh, yeah. um, a young uh, redneck Hillbilly man. Elegy? Yeah. J.D. Uh, Vance? Hillbilly. J.D. Vance, Vance yeah. Refrigeration? Yeah. Um, is it, is, yeah, Hillbilly Elijo Elid- Joe, Joe, Joe Rabbit? Rabbit? No, it is oh. not. That. Oh, shit. <laughs> yeah, I, 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 I'm thinking the same thing. Shit. <laughs> All right. Are, we, is, are we done on this No, one? no, wait. There's got to be one more hot one, one in, the, in the chamber here. Okay. We got to. So, <laughs> it is. From now on, you lose points if you get something worse than what it ends up being. <laughs> a, a, a young redneck man, not a boy, not recounts, a boy. recounts his time. Not a boy. Recounts his time in, in Nazi, Nazi Germany as he searched for his missing parents with his imaginary friend Hitler on a radio program. What's this? Okay. Redneck missing parents. I don't know what Jojo Rabbit's about other than Hitler and imaginary Hitler. Great. But good instincts. Does it, does it have parents in it? I don't <laughs> think so. Guys, we it. are looking for Jojo Dirt Rabbit. Yeah, there oh. we go. Jojo Dirt Rabbit. <laughs> Jojo Dirt Rabbit. That sounds like three kinds of motorcycles. Yeah. The Jojo, Jojo Dirt Rabbit. Dirt Rabbit. <laughs> All right, here we go. Next one. Four points. A heist goes wrong and a car chase of Mini Coopers break out, one driven by the famous founder of Apple Computers. The Italian jobs. I mean, the, right? there was zero... The Italian downtime. jobs. I'll sort of accepted the Italian Steve Jobs. There was which zero is like, downtime. Uh, uh, hey, you want a phone in your pocket? Uh, <laughs> there was zero downtime. It was like one long sentence, him describing it and you answering it. That was that. Yeah, everyone was here. <laughs> <laughs> Can I? Oh, I want to give Ryan my points for that one. <laughs> you know, I'll I mean, give Ryan half of them. Thank you. Thank it's you. currently twelve to seven. Ryan is still winning. Oh, did I take it's that, that that crazy Scientologist. <laughs> yeah, that really, that yeah. really got me. For got five me. points, an extreme sports athlete turned spy is recruited for a secret mission and discovers that a new AI is more sentient and powerful than imagined, all while in close quarters with its creator. 
Oh, uh, uh, what's the one with the the hot robot? Extreme sports. <laughs> well, you definitely outed how you feel about the robot before we found out what <laughs> oh, movie is. It, is. is it Triple what's, X Machina? Triple X Machina oh, is yeah. correct. Yes. One, two, three. Four for you. Okay, Ryan so gets one for saying hot robot. I was yes. on the right no, path. Yeah, saying hot I robot is what right did it path. for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what's one? And you're like, uh, triple uh, X Wally. <laughs> uh, short circuit. Yeah. <laughs> triple X Ch Chappy Triple X. What's the movie that made me look at my toaster oven differently? <laughs> uh, uh, the Jetsons XXX. <laughs> All right. So it is now 13 to 11. Oh, Ryan I'm losing. I'm winning still? Yes. Okay, Because you got that point for saying hot robot. Okay, so I just if that would have gone to Joe, it was a tie. Whew. This one is uh, six points. Two low-level astronomers go on a media tour to warn mankind of an incoming comet, and on their tour, they return to Neverland. Sexy seeing, telescope. <laughs> see, seeing their friends in, uh, that they abandoned as a child. Oh. I mean, okay, wait. Did you say that? It's don't two, look up two, plus something else. Plus up. Don't look up. <gasps> Don't look up, up. No, it isn't. <laughs> you Don't both got up. so excited. <laughs> Too low. I like this when I make them worth more points. I can distribute based on the input. Yeah. Two low-level astronomers go on a media tour to warn mankind of an incoming comet, and on their tour, they return to Neverland, seeing their friends and fairy they abandoned as a child. Oh, um. I mean, I mean, what's I mean the Neverland part? No, so it's it's got to be yeah. Like I mean. Maybe, what? Maybe it's not Don't Look Up. It's it not, has to be has Don't to Look be. Up. Don't Look Up. Uh, that would be really weird if there's a, look a up second movie Peter. exactly like that. Yeah, 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 don't I wouldn't, look up. I wouldn't, hook. I don't, don't hook up? Don't, don't hook up is oh! correct. <laughs> I was so close to getting there. One of the few ones that just makes the title of it's a just, completely yeah. different movie. <laughs> um, I say, so Ryan got Don't Look Up, so that'll be two... Four for Joe and two I was for withholding Ryan. the saying that because I didn't want to give clues. It's fifteen to, to set fifteen. Up Ryan. Pretty bad about that. <laughs> it's aren't fifteen I? to I just fifteen. Kinda like, you got more points on that one, Joe. You got right, you, feel, got, you got seventy five. I kind of just points. I'll feel don't have a. I just kind of say I, I, I'm, I, anything that's in my head. All right, there's two more, and I would call both of these bad, difficult, difficult. Yes. Oh, okay. A comedian examines the rise and fall of his relationship with a quirky woman in New York City. Taking uh, <laughs> a quirky woman in New York City. Amongst a mysterious quarantine zone of mutating plants and animals. Mm, mutating plants and animals. Uh, the, a comedian examines the rise and fall okay, of his relationship okay. with okay. the King of City. Or, not the King of Comedy. Uh, uh, Any Hollation? Any Hollation! Yeah. <laughs> Wait, what's the second one? Annihilation. <laughs> Any Hall and Annihilation? That's oh, a, that's that a, is seven points to one of you. Holy smokes. And you know what? It's Joe. <laughs> Anihilation. All right. That's a great one to say. And a bad one to say at the same time. Anihilation. It sounds like, yeah. That title was written by two people. I remember they, they said they referenced, I think it was Cheez It's Christ and Aaron. Way to go, gang. Uh, here we go. Final one. I believe this one was actually written by someone else. I, I might not have, I can't remember exactly who wrote this one. I might not be crediting them, but I credited them when they wrote it when I said, this is the funniest one I've seen in a long time. Here we go. A survivor of a concentration camp. This is how you can tell it's going to be the funniest one in a long time. A survivor of a concentration camp who is forced to make a terrible decision attempts to find a missing man with the help of its former Pokemon partner. A survivor of a concentration camp who is forced to make a terrible decision attempts to find a missing man with the help of their former Pokemon partner. A former Pokemon partner? Find a missing man with the help of their former Pokemon partner. I've got neither one of these. Well, okay. Is it their so former Sophie's partner? Choice is one of them. And then. Because so, so, uh, now if they can be in the middle of something. This oh, is yeah. opening it up to a whole oh, yeah. wide world of. Oh, yeah. This is the multiverse. Is it Sophie Mon's choice? It is not, but that's <laughs> fun. Um, I'm trying to think of any kind of. His former partner, a Pokemon. Oh, 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 oh. Detective um, Pika choice. Choice. Sophie's Detective Pika choice. Sophie's <laughs> Detective Pika oh, choice. It is. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, we did it. Hey, we did it. Well, that was seven. That's, I'm going five to Joe and two to Ryan. Okay, I felt like I really encouraged this was teamwork. him with this the... Was, with the right. I was like giving him the you're on a roll signal with yeah, my yeah, hand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Going into... Like, oh, you uh, got it, you got it. Go, it, go, it. go, go, go off. <laughs> um, and I was just like syllables, like... Chew, peek, <laughs> so. <laughs> Ryan's like, you know how many words it got letters in there somewhere? 